my YouTube channel. I hope everybody is at home safe and well. So for today, as you can see, iba na yung background ko, iba na yung kusina because we finally moved in into our new home. So actually, first time na magluluto ko sa kusina na to. So I really wanted to be special. So for today, sa isang episode ng Danny Cooks, I'm cooking something that my husband really loves. Like he really loves eating shrimp. So I had to learn how to um, cook shrimp specifically because I didn't really want to So I had to like learn from my mom, from him, and from, um, from other people. So this recipe I'm going to do today is garlic buttered shrimp. So, I'm going to do this and let's get to it. I'm going to show you guys the ingredients that we're going to use for today. So we have shrimp, of course. So this one is already marinated with Sprite. You can opt to use lemon, just lemon or Sprite or 7-Up. But ito, gumamit kami ng Sprite. So, marinate this for about 10 to 15 minutes. Longer, if kaya. But if nagmamadali kayo, 10 minutes is okay. And then, we have parsley. We have garlic. We have onions. We have tomato paste. Pepper. We have chili flakes. We have salt. And butter, of course. And, of course olive oil. So for today, since we are going to fry, ang gagamitin kong olive oil ay ang Dona Elana olive oil pomas because pomas is made specifically for frying and roasting. Ayan. If you guys don't know, fun, fun fact lang naman, kung gusto nyo lang naman nalaman, na kaya may three variants ang Dona Elana kasi it's basically for three different kinds of cooking. So itong extra virgin oil is for salad, uh, for salad dressing, or basically if you want to just stop your um, dish. Let's say after you cook, so you drill a little bit of extra virgin oil because it has a lot of health benefits. So that can be also for that. And again, for pomas, this is best for roasting and frying kasi hindi siya madaling masunog. Ayan. Ang extra virgin oil kasi sa sobrang extra virgin niya, guys, magbilis siya masunog. Kaya siya very, kaya siya, that, that's why it's called extra virgin because mabili siya masunog, hindi siya pwedeng sa high heat talaga. Ang tomas is, kaya-kaya niya to ng high heat. Pwedeng pang fry ng manok kung gusto niyo any. And then, ang pure naman is best for everyday cooking and pasta cooking. Ayan, mostly ito talaga yung gamit-gamit sa bahay. But when we fry, we use the tomas. Ayan, pang-pack lang naman. Okay, so let's get started with our garlic butter. First, our first step, the every every time I cook, our first step ko talaga is of course olive oil. We're going to use Dona Elana olive oil for mass. The next, of course, is butter. That is garlic butter shrimp. So, shrimp we need to butter. Yeah. And then let's just let that melt. Hey guys, so kaya ako nilalagyan ng olive oil ang butter kasi parang hindi masunod yung butter. Pag wala kasing olive oil, mabilis masunod yung butter, most especially pag high heat. So yeah. And kaya naman I use olive oil is because it has a lot of health benefits. And it's very, very flavorful. Basically, it elevates every meal that you cook. That's why I love to use olive oil. Ayan. Okay, so nagbap na yung butter natin. Let's put the onions first. Nakating ko na to dahil marami tayong tulutuin na shrimp. Ayan. After that, tinuin na natin ang ating garlic. Huwag kayong matakot mag-add ng maraming garlic. Actually, the more garlic, the better. Diba? Hindi naman siya garlic butter shrimp. Kung titi pa rin yung garlic, diba? Ayan. So, let's just let our onions and garlic cook. And then, after that, we're going to add our we're going to add our shrimp. As you can see, mataba-taba siya. Ayan. We're just going to cook this until the orange siya. Ayan. Again, guys, marinate your shrimp first before cooking with... Mahala kayo if you want to just marinate it with lemon, but kami here, we marinate it with Sprite for about 10 to 15 minutes. Some even do it overnight, di ba? Para talagang mawala yung lansan niya. Mahala naman, it's really up to you. So, I'm gonna just crack the heat up. So, make sure you don't over- 
overcook your shrimp because may hirapan kayong ipiin yung kapag overcook yung shrimp. Saka hindi rin siya masarap pag overcook. So, be careful. Pag nakita nyo orange na orange siya, pwede na yun. Okay, huwag yun ang antayin na mag-red pa siya. Ayan. Kapit na to. Okay guys, so kita nyo naman. Medyo luto na siya. Pumubukas na siya here. Ayan. So, pwede na tayo mag-add ng tomato paste. Let's just add that flavor, really. I'm just gonna get a spoon. Okay, so let's add our tomato paste. Konting konti lang. I, get, I swear, guys, yung konti na yun, marami ng lasa yan. So, huwag niyong to over to it. Okay, so, add this right there. Just mix it. Konting konting, ano lang, tomato paste. Add that flavor na yun. Salty taste. Mix, mix, mix. You can opt to put more tomato paste. It's really up to you. Ito kasi yung recipe. Ito yung version ko. Marami yung version pong garlic butter shrimp. I've actually watched a lot of versions. But this one is the one na nagustuhan ni Javi. So, sana magustuhan niyo rin. Ayan. Okay, and then now we're going to season our shrimp. Just a little bit of pepper. Here. And. We're going shrimp, so we can season more. Okay. And then. Salt, just a little bit, just a pinch of salt. Okay, maybe two. <laughs> and, and then. This one, the chili flakes, is optional. If you don't want to eat the chili, you don't want to eat the chili. But see, Happy likes it. A little bit of spike, kaya lang yung chili. Yeah. Kung tigsi pa lang. Yeah. And mix again. Pina lohit ko na siya para hindi siya maoin. Okay, hindi siya maoverkook. Yeah. Tapos kung ano? 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 The bibili yan sa grocery. Ayan. Let's just add in flavor para sa ating garlic butter shrimp. But again, if you don't have parsley at home, it's okay. The ingredients na inan ko are just optional. Ayan. And now, we can serve. Okay guys, now we're done. Let's plate. This looks amazing. Look at that. Look at that. Ayan niya magpahuli. Maayos yung plating ko. Parang impressive. <laughs> Bango niya talaga. Sana nakakamuli niyo ito right now, guys. Ito, nilalagay ko muna dito yung ano, shrimp. Tapos inubos ko yung sauce on top. Diba? Nakapakulo rin talaga. Ayan. And then, put ko lang dito. Hindi ito naka-on na. So, okay, mata ako. Then, put Look at that. Okay guys, so I'm gonna top our garlic butter shrimp with extra virgin oil. So, this is just going to add more flavor to it. And I'm going to put it towards the end. Just because, again guys, the extra virgin oil, na din siyang masunod. But, pwede na rin siyang in-drizzle sa inyong pagkain. Hindi nyo kailangan lutuin. So yeah, just a little bit. There you go. There you have it guys, that is my version of garlic butter shrimp. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you on my next video. But again pala guys, before I end this video, if you decide to make this at home, please don't forget to tag me with the hashtag Danny made me do it. And yes, bye guys, see you guys next time, stay safe. Okay guys, moment of truth, titikman niya na yung garlic butter shrimp ko. You know guys, being married is the best, but having a wife that cooks like this, parang alam mo yung nanalo ka na sa loto, tapos nanalo ka pa. Grabe. That's how I feel. <laughs> Grabe naman. It's very nice to my wife. When we met, di siya marunong magluto. Ngayon yung mga linaluto niya para sa akin. <laughs> Sige nga, go. Tikman mo. Okay, let's see. Proud ako dyan, ah. So, be nice. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, it's not overcooked because you can remove the shell quite easily. Okay, so. Oh, see, buo pa, oh. <laughs> okay, so, so two yeah. points, two points. Mm -hmm. So let's okay. actually, you know, guys, Bob's up. So. Hello. Asarap, dinga. It's not top. It's sweet. There's garlic, there's onion, there's butter. <laughs> Sarap, guys. Dito na kaka umay. Okay, ah. so rate it. 1 out of 10, 87 million. Grab. <laughs> okay, thank you. Gusto mo yun? Gusto ko yun. <laughs>